Well, hello, YouTube. <laughs> yes, it's Melissa Trace back. Still alive. I ended up getting an, a cold, a stinking head cold after that darn COVID-19. Anyway, I wanted to do a quick video for you guys of some haul that we did prior to being sick. Now, this was all, all these items, when I'm a little tangled, hold on. Sorry, I got my wires here. Um, these items that I'm gonna, about to show you were in my last, last video before Christmas. And so I wanted to recap that. Um, these items that I'm going to be showing you on the table here have not been listed. They are previous hauls. And uh, so, yeah, let's get started. So this great little chef tray, a uh, bunch of chefs with um, on a little, you know, petit four tray, um, Sonoma, really nice. Um, I, I love this. I think it's adorable and I'm trying to break it, but this was in the, the last, last video. <laughs> um, this, I love New York cup. My husband picked that up. He really liked it. Nice and clean. And, um, yeah, so that's pretty cool. I don't know if you can see that or not. Yep. There we go. So, uh, we're going to list that. Um, and that was in the last, last video. These ties that he found, great ties that he found. Um, these were also in the last, last video. <laughs> and these are such nice. Look at this. Look at this poo. I just love poo. <laughs> so these were all in the last, last video. And they just feel really nice. Nice quality. He really knows his stuff, I'll tell you. So this is all the new items that are going to be listed. Um, I came across some really snazzy uh, dress shirts, which I thought were nice. Uh, I think these are all short sleeved except for this one up here. But we've got L.L. Bean. I love the color of it. The buttons are really great. Here's a St. John's Bay. Now, I don't know how well these will do, but I just really like the fabric. Just felt really good, especially on this shirt here. It just, it's soft. Now, all of these items have been washed, but I have not pressed them. So I may press them. I may just run them through the washer again. This is Hager. Um, just a really nice quality shirt. I believe this is short sleeve. I believe this one is short sleeve and this one is short sleeve. This one is the Gap. Not a great big quality item, but the the actual um, shirt itself is very nice quality. So that's why I picked it up. And it is long sleeved, so I thought that was pretty cool. Now these were really cute. We got Zinfidel, Cabernet Sauvignon, Chardonnay, Pignon Grigio, and... Um, I think there's a couple more out there floating around, but I got a set of four, so I thought, yeah, why not? They're so cute. These are wall hangings. This was very nice. I've seen this um, type of uh, pottery before, and um, it is marked USA. Sorry, I got that upside down. It is marked USA, and uh, like I said, it's really nice quality piece and I've seen that before and I can't remember what it's called but I thought oh I'm picking that up definitely okay and I'm gonna go around the table here and my husband found this it's a Wilton brand and it's little loaf pans I thought that was so fun so yeah uh, let's see a couple books um, <clears throat> This one is <clears throat> Mr. and Mrs. Fitzwilliam Darcy, Two Shall Become One. Of course, he picked this out. And then this book, Moo, I have no idea what it's all about, but he picked it up, and it's a novel. And then this great piece, I believe this is Hager. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is Hager. And um, Hager? Mm, no, I might be wrong about that, 
But isn't he cute? This is a great planter. I just think that is just adorable. I was so surprised when we found this too. And it's in, it's in really good shape. Um, there's no chipping of major um, incidents, but I think there's one little chip right uh, there. I don't know if we'll focus or not. Probably not, but one tiny little chip there and the rest of it is all in great condition so he's super cute so he's going up on the sail block and then last but not least this great uh canister set it's so pretty it's ceramic porcelain i don't i don't know <clears throat> it's breakable of course and i'm gonna try to sell it and, and mail it i don't know what i'm thinking of but yeah it's got this little basket weave design here don't know the year on this set, but it's a nice set. Let's see if there's anything on the bottom here. Oh, 1978. Anesco, 1978. Let's see if we can. There you go. Yeah, made in Japan. Very pretty. Very, very pretty. And so all the pieces are intact and are very clean. And. There's that one. Um, I came across this one, however. Sorry, my wires. And there is damage here, but it was repaired. Doesn't look terrible, but it doesn't look great either. And it goes all the way through. But, I mean, this could be used for like tea bags, something like that. I wouldn't put anything liquid in it. The rest of it is in good shape I mean the rest of it is not broken it was just that lid so I would say use it for tea bags or something like that and I'll disclose all that too in the listing but yeah it's really a nice nice set and I think we can we can send it out for maybe 45 50 dollars I don't know what do you guys think anybody have any opinions on that if you do send them my way Hold on one second. Sorry, I had a coworker that I had to discipline. Anyway. <laughs> so there you have it. I wanted to showcase what's going to be listed next. And um, uh, after getting, sorry, after getting all that uh, jewelry listed, um, I'm ready to do some big fun things. So Okay, everyone, have a great day. Happy New Year. It's going to be a great 2022. I think the reseller is going to be on the top of the heap this year. All right, everybody, have a great day. Bye. And don't forget, some people think it's trash, but to Mrs. T, it's treasure. Okay, bye, guys. Thanks for watching. And we'll see you again soon. Bye.